Hi, Manish Mehta here, previewing week four, the two and one Jets traveling up to Buffalo to play the winless Bills. The Jets riding high, looking for their third consecutive win and third consecutive in the division as well. Plenty of storylines in Jetland as always. First and foremost, it doesn't appear that Darrell Revis will be back from his strained hamstring. Uh, Revis still did not uh, practice with the hamstring, so questionable there but uh, have, I don't want to rule him out yet because I'd hate to be fined by the league if he did play. Look for Drew Coleman possibly to take his spot in the starting lineup. And just if we focus on every play like we have been doing the last couple games, we'll be okay. Uh, on other injury fronts, Calvin Pace, who's coming back from foot surgery, Looks like he may be available in certain situations. Rex Ryan mentioned this week that perhaps he'd be back for passing downs, third downs. And uh, as Calvin Pace said, being on a trainer's table is like being in an insane asylum. So he's definitely itching to get back as well. You know, it's, it's tough being in the training room. It's just good to get back out there and um, just run around a little bit. You know, it's, you know, just kind of get back in the flow. And, um, as the week goes along, Probably do more and more, but today was just an individual period for me. So uh, after I did that, I did some, you know, some agility work, a little running, and everything felt good. Uh, on the other side of the ball, it's all Mark Sanchez all the time. The quarterback has been on fire the last couple weeks. This season, six touchdowns, no interceptions. That's saying a lot for a guy who had 20 interceptions in 15 regular season games. And as Rex Ryan said this week, Sanchez is really turning into the quarterback that they believed he could be coming off that strong postseason. And that's it for now. Be sure to follow us on the Jetstream blog and NewYorkDailyNews.com in addition to Twitter at Twitter.com backslash the Jetstream.